Hey everyone, this is Tim from Your Six Studios. Today in this video, I'm gonna go ahead and show you how to change your PlayStation 4 and PlayStation 5's account password using the mobile application. So let's go ahead and jump in the video right now. So let's say your PlayStation 4 has been stolen or your PlayStation 5 has been hacked. How would you go ahead and change your password? Well, one way that you can do that if you don't have your PlayStation in front of you is by using the mobile application. I'm gonna go ahead and show you how to do that now. So if you don't already have the PlayStation app on your iPhone or Google device, go to the Play Store or the iPhone Store and select it. Then just at the top, go to the search bar and type for PlayStation app. So mine is right here. And this is what it will say, PlayStation app by PlayStation Mobile Inc. So let's go ahead and install this and open it up. So I'm already signed in with my email address and password associated with my PlayStation account. So now that we're on the home screen here, and the home screen will be the one with the little controller in the bottom left, and you can see your account, and then this little cog thing right here, and this is the settings section. Let's select this. It'll bring us to this settings page. Let's scroll down under here, and then go to PlayStation Network, and then just select account information. Once we select this, we will see our name, language, and residence. Well, in the upper left, if we select these three horizontal lines, it will bring us to our accounts page where we can see security. Let's select security. And then continue. Now it's going to bring us to a page where we can change our password. So we can see our security questions, mobile number. Well, let's select edit password. Now we have to type in our current password. Now let's type in a new password. Then scroll down and re-enter it. Okay, so I have my current password and my new password in here. Now let's go to save. Okay, so my new password has been updated and saved with my PlayStation account. Now, next time you log into your PlayStation, you might have to sign in again with your email address and your new password. So the connection to my PlayStation app has been lost. So I'm going to have to sign in once again using the PlayStation application. So now over on my PlayStation 5, my account has been signed out. If I go up to settings and then go to users and accounts, I will have to go ahead and sign back in to my account. So if someone is using your account without your permission, you can just change the password and they won't be able to play online. So let's go ahead and type in my password again and then I will be able to sign in and play. So hopefully this video did indeed help you out. If it did, go ahead and leave it a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel down below for more PlayStation 5 tech out videos coming up next on Your Six Studios.